With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question says the viability of seeds can be ascertained with the help of IAA, ABA, TTC, or NADP. So, what is this viability of seeds? As we all know, that seeds they are produced by ovules, whereas ovary they help in production of fruits. So, after some time, the parent it disperses all the seeds. so that whenever favorable condition arises these seeds can germinate but these seeds have a specific timeline in which they need to germinate for example all the food that we the food packets that we take from market that we buy from market they all have an expiry date written on them right all the medicines have expiry date so just take it viability of the seeds as an expiry date of seeds so viability of seeds it is nothing but basically the time span in which the seed needs to be germinated or else the nutrient the reserve food that seed have it will get exhausted and result in death of the seed so this is known as viability of seeds and for example you get a seed it is it is a seed of extremely rare plant and the plant was found long ago on earth and now you want to test if the seed is still viable or not so you are going to do the test with the help of ttc what is this ttc ttc stands for triphenyl tetra zonium salt or tetra zonium chloride so as the name suggests tetrazonium salt it is also known as tetrazonium salt and this salt it helps in detection of an enzyme which is very active in viable seeds which is known as dehydrogenase this is an enzyme which is very active in viable seeds what this enzyme do is it converts this tetrazonium salt into formazine and this reaction this reaction gives the colorless solution of ttc it changes the colorless solution of ttc to reddish or pinkish when formazone is made formazone converts this colorless ttc into a reddish or pinkish solution and it tells us that this seed it is still viable but what happens if uh, another color is obtained for example if you obtain yellow or bluish color any abnormal color abnormal color other than these two colors this means that the seed it is very weak very less amount of dehydrogenase is present in that seed and that seed may or may not be viable depending upon the conditions it will be provided with to grow and germinate so this was the second situation now the third situation if you get no color then what will happen this means the seed has expired so the no color means that seed is not viable anymore now how is this test done you take your seed cut it into half so that the embryo it is visible keep the half part where embryo is visible soak it into ttc overnight if the next day you get reddish color viola you got a really rare uh, plant seed if you get any abnormal color that means the seed may or may not be able to uh, germinate and if you get no color sorry for you no seed no plant for you so the answer to our question will be option 3 ttc for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today